So there's this thing that's been watching me since I was a kid that no one else can see. But they never really did anything but stand there, so I just like went with it, you know? I forgot it was there most of the time, so it spooked me every so often, but that was it. Like, I didn't even think that I could maybe interact with it until the other day. After talking for like a minute, we decided to talk about why it had been following me for my whole life over tea. After a little bit of awkwardness, I learned that this thing was the ghost of a medieval peasant woman whose death I had been partially responsible for in a past life. Apparently, she was the village beauty, and I was her lover. I also happened to be a knight. Isn't that sick? I wore armor. Anyway, cause she was like beautiful or whatever, this immortal wizard was like, you will be mine, and she was like, no, and he then used some magic to convince me to kill her. And then he cursed her to watch me for like all of eternity, but that only works until he dies or whatever. And then she was like, I don't like being a ghost. Can you kill the wizard? And I was like, yeah, I've got time to burn. I'm procrastinating on selecting my major, so I can do that for you. So we went out and we were like looking for the wizard. Um, we were really struggling though. We were actually about to give up hope, but then through some clever thinking on my part, I figured out the secret. My favorite artist, Darwiz Liv, was actually the evil wizard. I was devastated. Keep listening to the mixtapes they made you. Overanalyze every single word you hear. Was this a sign that things were going wrong? No, no. You were the one who cared too hard, not them. Stay up every single night staring at your phone, either attempting to gather up the courage to turn these demons constant reminders of your loneliness into nothing more than a bad dream or praying just for one second you could feel the warmth of equally return love go out for coffee four times a week by yourself always bring your notebook never stop writing leave little comics and thank you notes with your tip watch them smile as you get in your car Talk down on yourself whenever possible. My life is shit because I deserve it, right? You must have done something really bad. It's nearly impossible for you to cry now. Avoid your friends for weeks, even though they're- After that angst party, I thought about the ghost lady. She was still here because some douchey wizard was a neckbeard back forever ago. I said that I would help her out. So I'm gonna get the wizard. So like basically I've been sending him really mean medieval insults on social media uh, so he'll know what's up and like eventually I'll tell him where I am and we can have like an ultimate showdown or whatever. Okay, uh, so when are you going to be done? Because we're going to dinner and we're wondering if you wanted to come. Oh yeah, I can go.